Honestly, uh, I've always been interested in teeth, like keeping my teeth clean, like keeping the whitest smile that I can keep. Uh, I've done plenty of deep cleans in my life, you know what I mean? Multiple whitening sessions, which I probably shouldn't have done, but it's okay. Uh, I care about my smile. So uh, that's one main reason. Uh, secondly, is I feel like the smile is the basis of anybody. You know, you look at somebody, they give you a nice smile, you're, you're more comforted, I guess, you know what I mean? Rather than someone that doesn't really take pride in that, you know? So that's why I wanted to be in the dental field. Uh, and also I picked Indigo because all of the other programs, they were either too strenuous when it came to the time and I couldn't adhere to like the schedule or it, it just didn't work at all in any aspect, you know what I mean? Indigo has, like you said, the hybrid schedule and whatnot and it works perfectly for me. So I, I don't have to sit there and try to struggle during the week and come after work or take time off of work in order to come to school because it's on Saturdays, so, you know, which is perfect for me as a father of one. Honestly, I, I didn't feel like I could take that step until it was offered to me. Like once, once I applied and I got an email back saying that, hey, we'd love for you to, you know, undergo an interview and I talked to the people. They are like, we, well, you'd be a, a great, we feel like you'd be a great fit for this. And I'm like, okay, never, never really felt like, you know, anybody would say that to me when it came to a dental assistant, you know, but I have always had that, an admiration for this field. So, and yes, I would like to further my education. So. Uh, depending on how long it takes to be a dentist, <laughs> depending on how long, but want to become an RDA, like that's that's for a fact. However, once I get there, that's when I'm going to make my decision if I want to do the hygienist route or do a dental route, like become a dentist. So right now, I'm not sure. I, I just do know that I do want to further in this career. That's like asking a person that wants to build his own house why he wants to be in construction. You know what I mean? Like, if I can do my own work and work on my son and, you know, or, or just have information for them to, to, to do better in life when it comes to their hygiene or when it comes to their teeth, you know, that maybe they didn't know or wouldn't have known if I wouldn't have took this path, you know? So, whatever the case may be. Oh, the, the low cost is, is beautiful. Like, I, I haven't ran into another program that has anything less or matching the price that you guys have. So for one, the, the cost is amazing. It's only a three month long program. And as an adult, you know how fast three months goes by. So if you can't, if you can't do a three month program, get it, get it over with, you know, and, and further your life and, and get ahead in life. Because I know at one point that I didn't know exactly where I wanted to go in life, you know? And when I found this, I was like, got it, gotta run with it, you know? Uh, and as far as the future students, I'd say just be a sponge, you know, because I, I wish I would have really soaked in every little bit of thing that I could because that's that's not going to do anything but, but help you later on in your career. So I just, just be a sponge, pay attention, volunteer as much as you can when it comes to doing anything, when it, whether it be mixing alginate, whether it be mixing stone, whether it be making a bleaching tray, x-ray, uh, working on the Dexter, whether it be doing your BLS training, like just, just get out there and volunteer. Like that, that's what I would tell the students, you know what I mean? Don't, don't be scared to get out there and ask questions because there, there's nobody, everybody here is on the same level, except for the teachers, of course, you know what I mean? So, so ask questions. Don't be scared to ask questions. They're, gonna, they're, they're there to help. So. That's what I'd say. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like anyone that like is stuck in life, like I said, that doesn't know where to decide to go, like just take a chance. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, it's only it's it's, it's not much money if you, if you don't further it past the year. It's, but it's also a great skill to have, you know. So just take a chance. Take a chance. That's it.